YouTube. It's the word with it, man. We back, we back. Another reaction on the bus today, man. We got one from uh Pretty Boy Fredo, man. Said he got seven women versus a one virgin. Now we all know how uh Fredo is, man. We done seen the, the Mikey shit. Hopefully this shit is genuine. Um we finna dive right into this shit, man. Let's see what he's talking about. Today, my friend Jake is gonna be going on his very first date. He's 26 years old, and because of his disability, he's had a hard time finding love. So I'm gonna be matching him up with seven beautiful ladies to help him find his very first love. I shaved one time. There we go! Is it long? What's the disability about? Like, which one you got? Oh, shit. Man, I'm trying to go back to the old days, y'all. Y'all remember the, the good days, my nigga, when shit was so fucking simple. Nobody expected shit from me. Nobody gave a fuck about me on these streets. But I was making good content. I was making content that made me feel fucking alive, bro. One thing that's very close to my heart would be able to use the resources that, for what I have, not to like flex on other niggas, but to help people, to inspire people, to motivate people. That's the shit that I'm getting fucking back to. So today, I'm gonna meet somebody very special that I it's so hard to believe, bro. It really is. Just by all the shit that this nigga done, done to motherfuckers. Like, it's just hard to believe, gang. I hope I hope he is going back to that shit. Um But sometimes this shit be just seeming for clicks, like come on gang. You know how brutal females is. And I've been wanting to meet for a long time. My dog Jake motherfucking future is a streamer who has cerebral palsy. He's somebody that I look up to, somebody that I'm inspired by. What I'm hoping is that I can do what I used to do, bro. Just spend a good day with the kid, have fun, turn up, give back to him, him and his family, and just have a good fucking day. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't really think too much into it. Just enjoy this city with Jake Future. So hopefully I can make this one of the best days Jake has ever had. Yeah. Yeah. My nigga Jake. How you doing, bro? It's been a minute. Years. Years. Seen a cyber before? <laughs> Get in that bitch, Jake. Yeah. Hey, Jake. On my mission to make this Jake's best day ever, of course we gotta take my boy shopping, but I wanted to know what would make this day special for him. He told me that he had never been on a date. So today, I'm gonna be taking Jake on his very first date. What's the type, Jake? It don't matter to me. <laughs> Look, I'll make sure you pull it out as one. Okay. Like, I'm putting pressure on you, bruh. Yeah. Might have to. I don't know, I had to kiss one of them bitches. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's really times like this that really. I'm really trying. I'm really trying, y'all. I'm really trying. That part was tough. That part was tough. We ain't gonna talk about it bring me back to earth and just make me appreciate these type of moments because somebody like jay who may have a disability in other people's eyes in my eyes no matter the cards that he's dealt he's still living his life to his best potential before we get into today's video i want to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor cases this isn't this is real cases and my Introduce yourself and tell us one interesting fact about yourself. Um, my name is Jordan. I am from New That's Jersey. Nice. I've moved like I think 13 times within New Jersey in my entire life. Like I went to three different high schools. My name is Gianca. I'm from Brooklyn and I'm like super flexible. <laughs> Wait, what? Say that one more time? Wait, I said what? I'm super flexible. Yeah, all of that. My name is Aaliyah. I'm from Jersey. I like to dance. My name is Sydney, and I walked in my first Paris Fashion Week this February and got published in Vogue and Harper's Bazaar. Yay! 
Five. My name Five. is Fernanda. I'm a model. I'm a dancer. My name is Atma Romero. I'm from Venezuela. And fun fact about me, I'm a professional dancer. My name is Divine. A fun fact about me, well, I always have 27 different tabs open, so you'll never be bored. Based upon their introduction, who do you feel like intrigued you the most? Probably number four. Whoa, number four. He had to, to tell them. He had to tell them. On my soul, he had to tell them. He had to. Because we know how brutal, br uh, we know how brutal females are, gang. He had to tell them about this shit. Go through and ask one question. They all get one question each before, you know, we do some eliminations. What is your McDonald's order? Our fish salad. Uh. <laughs> Girl number two, I have a question. What's the disability about? Like, which one you got? What? That Wait, that is a crazy question. I mean, he don't ask that. He just, he just, he just talks a bit long. <laughs> <laughs> no, bro, she know. She gotta know. She ain't trying to laugh. She like, fuck nah. She like, nah. Damn. Here when I thought this nigga changed, man. This nigga Fredo fucked up, man. I know the comments probably crazy right now. I know they is. He just, he just, his tone is just a bit low. Oh, so he don't got nothing at all? Okay, say that. <laughs> you got a Number three, number three. Oh. Is it long? That's what I wanna know. <laughs> <laughs> That's my question. That's my question. Whoa, Jake! That's it. You wanna know what the snake, the Jake snake, like? Yeah, the snake. Look and tell us. Wait, check, tell check. Jake. What the fuck, man? Oh my God! Probably. Okay, I wanna know what he does for a living. He's a streamer. Why would you take me on a first day? Like, would you take me to the beach? Cause I love the beach. Yes, I would take you out to. Yeah, but what is the sweetest or nicest thing a girl for, could do for you? I would talk to me. Talk to me. Hey, can I ask one more question? Wait, who's that? Number one. Oh, mm -hmm. I was hoping that wasn't number two. <laughs> you know it. I got a question too now. Um, <laughs> is your love language, your, your top, like, one or two love languages? Touch. My boy said he want that physical touch. <laughs> Girl number two, um, what's your body count? I don't have one yet. I You're a virgin? Maybe tonight, maybe tonight. <laughs> oh shit, Jake. Jake about to get freaky. And one more question. Damn. You about to get some sympathy, puss. No cap, though. No cap. No cap. She probably could give him some sympathy, puss, though. Last question. God, Last no. question. Last question. Do you like hairy girls? Landon Street. No, no, no. We I'm saying like, do, is he grown? Like he don't care for girls. It's a shade. grown ass man. Yeah. Tell him a grown ass man. I don't care about no hairy shit. Yeah. I don't care about no hairy shit. Yeah. <laughs> 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 First official round. Jake will now start eliminating the girls. Narrow the options down. What do you do for you? I'm number one. My name is Jordan, and I am a model and a TikTok influencer. It's Gianca. Like I'm number two, and I do OnlyFans and a bunch of other stuff. How far do you go on that OnlyFans? Like, we talking like, what's the furthest you go on there? Um, DP. Huh? Double Damn. Nah, you're lying, right? Yeah, huh? like, everything, everything, everything. So you do DP? Damn. I did it. So I work with autistic kids. Um, I'm like a teacher aide. I'm an actress, model, singer. I feel like both of these, both, number one, number number three, or that number, yeah, one and three, I feel like they know. I feel like they know. I'm a dancer and I have my own production company. I'm a model and also a brand ambassador. Well, I'm a professional dancer and choreographer. I'm a mixologist slash bar director. Who would you uh, like to eliminate this round? Number two. Hi. 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 Oh, he's cute. Yeah. Okay. I want you to eliminate <laughs> them based she, upon she just, their smell. Yeah, Hi, like Jake. All right, here we go. Smell her, Jake. Oh, big as hell. I'm sorry, this is funny. All right, what you think, Jake? What you think? What you think? I'm calling you. 
What you think, Jake? What you think, Jake? <laughs> My boy twitching. Hold on. Good. Get up there. Get up there. Yeah, she smell like. Good. 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 All right. Came out. She, she wanted to show the ass. Based upon the smells, who smelled the best out of all six of the girls? No, G. Let's give a round of applause for number three. <laughs> Which one of these motherfuckers did not smell good to you, Jake? Which one was it? No, it's seven. Oh! Yeah. It's lucky number seven, uh, Jake. Whoa. Do you regret it? Oh. <laughs> I would cry. It gives cotton candy, but I don't know. Regret it? No. Keep someone, though. <laughs> what do you want on a first date? Um, I'm a foodie, so anything that involves food, um, I like to get active too. So, so my ideal first date, honestly, I'm just a lover girl. So I just, as long as I could be with you, like anywhere, that's like the best thing that I like. My ideal date would be something that would be good for the both of us. I love food and I love sports. And I think going to a sports game, I've never been to a basketball game, but I would love to go. I'm Peruvian, so I'll take you to a Peruvian restaurant. I love to party and I love to get drunk, so just get me drunk. Let's go out. Let's see, we outside. What would you eliminate? Do you you regret your decision, Jake? <laughs> now you lying, Jake. Bad. Come on, Jake. <laughs> Oh, she's so you don't regret it? <laughs> Yo, I love they it. said, fuck it. No, you don't regret it? No. Are you a loyal girl and have you ever cheated before? And if so, please tell the story how you cheated. I have never cheated on anybody. I'm a loyal girl, Scorpio, yeah. Ever been cheated on before? Yes. This dude gave me chlamydia twice. So, uh, yeah. He did what? Yeah. Twice, y'all. I'm so serious. It's okay. It's okay. You know, you live and you learn. You learn the lessons. Oh. I'm not no cheater, but like, oh. I don't like the worst. Oh. But, oh. I'm not no cheater, but I will say men cheated on a girl with me. I'll be honest. That's probably like the worst thing. That was bad. That's like bad. I'm sorry, y'all. Don't like, I don't believe that. All of y'all haven't cheated. I'm really trying to find my bro some love. So like, can somebody be honest? Like, we do appreciate honesty. Tell the truth. Tell them, tell the truth. Yeah, tell the truth. We just want y'all to be honest. If you cheated, you cheated. No, but what makes you think we're cheaters? I don't think y'all are. I, How do you know I, he doesn't have good I just taste? think the odds are weird, okay? One out of four, I think at least, maybe possibly. You can even get some last two. Okay, we're gonna see the light. Oh, you got number six? Hold on. Not even Actually, not. Actually, hold on, Jake. Hold on, Jake. Hold on, Jake. Number four. No, she has. Hi, my she name is Sydney. I'm number four. I have never no, cheated, has. but I was in a four year relationship. Right. You're right. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> no, That's crazy. That's so crazy. Or I have never cheated, but I was in a four year relationship. Hi, my name is Sydney. I'm number four. I have never cheated, but I was in a four year relationship. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> Number six. Have you ever cheated or ever been cheated on? Number six. Did you just yeah. pay with PayPal? Yeah. And the cashback's wild. Mm, I cheat one time. There we go. Yeah. Listen. There we go. No. There we go. Where did it start? Listen. I knew it. Listen. I was 16 years old, and you know what I mean. I got in a relationship, I used to live with this man, and he cheated on me a couple times, so I guess that was my karma, so don't cheat. Based on those answers, who do you feel like had the best answer for you, bro? Number six. Damn! Okay. She will be honest. You being honest? Yeah. Based on the answers, who do you feel like was fucking lying? Number four. All right, number four, we're going to go ahead and have to eliminate you. I'm sorry. Right. It was not to be you. Oh, Jay, whoa. Now that you get to see her, she I ain't gonna lie, she was pretty sweet. Do, do you regret your decision? Oh, no. Damn. My boy said no regrets. Ask one question on your side, and based upon that question, we gon' we gonna have my dog eliminate, okay? If you could start a nonprofit organization, um, what community would you help and why? Make a wish. 
foundation. I really like to help, you know, other, other, people. other people. Are you the type that if this person's hungry, you will give your, your last? Like, would you give your last to somebody? I will buy some food. If you had like a, like a partner or whatever, and that person doesn't have their papers, the papers, right? To live here in America. Shit, hell, no. Would you get married with a person? Say, hell, to hell, no. Like, would you yeah, get married somebody. with a person and help her? No, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Shit, Jay. That was my question. I will help the person. Okay, that's you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You tell me that's you. <laughs> yeah. Who you gonna eliminate? You know. No, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, number six. Oh, oh, no. oh Venezuela. Okay. <laughs> All right, Jake. No. Jake, come on. No. Now, you done said that to every single one. Now, you lying, Jake. Jake, we are down to our last two girls. Give us your final reason why Jake should pick you. I'm very ambitious. Uh, I'm a hustler. I'm going to always get to everything yeah, yeah, I need to get done. Cool. I don't want nothing codependent. I need you to be really dependent within yeah. yourself. Security. Why should Jake pick you for his date? You should pick me because um, I'll take care of you. I like to get to my money, so I like my man to also get to his money, but I also will take care of my man. That's just me. That's just what I like to do. Who is going to be the person you are going to eliminate? Number one. All right. Damn. All right, Jake. Do you regret your decision, Jake? Yeah. Yeah! Oh, oh, oh. That, I told you, That's bro. That's the first one on That's the first one. That's the first one on Yo, that, I told you. So that's yeah. beautiful girl. Yeah. Oh, oh, shit, somebody. Jake. Well, number one, thank you so much. All right, don't look, don't look, don't look, don't look. Count of three. One, two, three. Wow. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs>
it probably was in a good place because he probably don't get that many, you know what I'm saying, options or dates from girls, but that's not the end of the world, man. You could have just hung out with him, did some meaningful sh- shit with him, you know what I'm saying, planned a whole day for him type shit, and that would have, that would have, that would have just hit better, bro. It would have hit harder. This shit right here. This one it, Fredo. I ain't gonna hold you. This one it, man. Great video, though. But this just one it, gang. This one it. This this <laughs> this one it, gang. Y'all let me know in the comments, man. What y'all think, man? I'll get back at y'all.